Hello and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. If you have to reload this injured the mad. Do you have anything else that's nice here? Yeah. Okay. We can talk here. Uh let's see. Ya. But this I guess if we get her out of here. Planning to unleash their best men against us. If you get her out of this so complex that should help with her health. I suppose. We're still on how little we know, so let's move on. Of course, I still don't know where the people are whom I'm supposed to talk to. How did they get upstairs? Over there. In that case, we're going to use the staircase. Those free side thugs aren't worth our time anymore. Good for you. Alright. That is the office of someone. Nothing in the filing cabinets, nothing in the desk. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay, let's try this one instead. Big South Terminal. And safe. Uh, okay, everyone is in here. I'm sure no one will enter here, so let's look inside here sounds like a good plan huh, that broke that breaking was not part of the plan honest black main note and then the terminal ignorance no well that means it can't be influenced either or oh. a, lot, a lot of these uh, options increased a company must be it, but I'm gonna remove that and see if I can get my allowance replenished. Allowance replenished, okay. Apparently the one I thought that might be it then is the one that was completely removed. Virtually? Okay. I read virtually, so I thought it starts with an I and was like, huh, oh, that's not a word. Okay, never mind. If you aren't big cell, keep your grubby fucking fingers to yourself. Well, that was necessary. Alright, let's give it a good read. Hey boss, we took care of Troik just like you asked. Troik, the stupid bitch that tried to run away made the perfect patsy. We got double benefit of her stinking body serving as a warning to the rest of the girls. Troik was so fucked up that spite that spy Chet we could have stabbed him in the balls and he would have said Daisy. We're going to take a little vacation for a bit. Troik might have seen one of our faces while we were drifting in and out. We don't want him to get suspicious. Hopefully that scorn little fuck that's some good business for you. Thanks for the bonus, boss. Well, apparently Troy did kill anyone. Good for him. This still doesn't explain the involvement of the other fair folk in the area there. Okay. Apparently going to suits is a good idea. On the other hand, so is going downstairs. Khan's finally got what they had coming. Blammy. It's great that this, and at least one other party, appreciates what we have done with the Khans. We just murder them. Hello. What the fuck is that thing? You mean that thing? It's my bad. It's easy. It is a friendly thing. We kill the fiend's leader. Well, I don't, I didn't see him doing anything in that battle, really. Like, why? What does he get credit for? What does he demand credit for, even? Eight. This looks very similar to the song we just did. You again? Make it quick. Uh. A full proof of your blackmail. Well, that motherfucker. What the hell? Damn. Thanks for finding this. This would be plenty of proof to cover my ass if they try to rat me out to any authorities. Okay, so what can you tell me about the guns they might just have? They're keeping them in a little utility section down off the basement. I don't know what they're arming themselves for, but I know it isn't for the good of mankind. How do you get the guns into the strip? I'm pretty proud of myself. It's a stroke of genius if I could be so modest. 
The whole arrangement starts with an old buddy of mine in the Republic. He's responsible for packing and shipping supplies to the NCR on the Strip. He marks some containers as food and medical and packs them with guns and other shit. From there, it took just a couple of greased palms to get someone to let me cherry pick a container or two out of every shipment. Easy as pie. Hmm. I have a couple more questions about the guns. Okay. Try and be fast about it. Uh, where did the guns come from? I've made a lot of contacts over the years. I have some friends back in California that can get their hands on just about anything. Mostly, I've been calling in every last favor I have. All right, more. Uh, what, what can we do to take care of the guns? As a little pet project, I've been making some thermite. Thermite burns as hot as the devil's asshole and can melt through just about anything. I've been keeping it so if the family betrays me, I can hopefully do some damage before I end up dead or in jail. If you don't deploy the thermite yourself, I'll tell the bosses what you've been planning. Uh, isn't it riskier though? Okay, I'll try it myself. Okay, here's the thermite and a key to the room where the guns are stored. Place the thermite on the crates in the room. I rig the light switch outside the room to kick off a spark big enough to hold the thermite. That should turn that shit into molten slag. As soon as we're done talking, I'm gonna make myself like a ghost. I don't wanna be anywhere near here when the bosses find out. Good idea. See ya. Okay, cool. Be safe. Alright. Let's sneaky sneak. Because it might be dangerous. Dangerous. Yes. Those are words. Food lockers. I'll take everything. Do I need to place termites in here as well? Yeah. And here? Yeah. And here? Yeah. That's all the termite used. So we can leave now. Come on now. Question is, how do I power that? Sure, there must be a way. There's some serious shit going on between NCR. What is my quest at the moment, anyway? Are in the Legion. They better not fuck with our power. The job is to find the light switch. Where my markers point me downstairs. Huh. Bosses don't like no trouble in their place. That is understandable. Now the boss is aware that I'm going to burn down their guns. Because I'm hoping they're not. Ah, uh, this one. Let's walk away. Still didn't find out what the understand. The other guy is all about that. <sighs> Welcome back to Gamora. Find yourself a girl or a guy and have a drink. Your family. Ah, that's good to know. I didn't know I was family. If I had known I was family, I probably would have set everything on fire. Hey, what can I do for you? I destroyed all the guns. Whoa, you managed to pull that off? Solid work. That ought to gum up the boss's plans. What's the next step? Now we cut off the head of the serpent. Big Saul and Nero have to die. Why do they need to die? As long as they're alive, they can start up their plans again. All you've managed to do is stall them. I guarantee you they have contingencies. 
All right. All right then. Hurry and get ready. I'll give you a gun when you get to the room. I have a gun. It's a this is gun. I'm going to have to assume that we go to the offices that we were at before from which we stole the information. The blackmail material. Probably. Yeah. Those look like people. Hello. Hey, you're Kachino's friend. You got business with me? What kind of business do you do here? We run a hotel. What do you think our business is? Okay. Alright, come back anytime. You? Hey, you're the one everyone's talking about. What business you got with me? What kind of business do you do here? All kinds of business. Most of it is ours. Nice. Bye. Well, I'm just gonna... Sit here. Do nothing. And wait for a companion to show up so I can shoot you. Without you noticing. Just sit here quietly. Don't mind me. Nothing suspicious. Hey, here's that gun I promised you. I suggest using it while they are talking. Let's have I'm pretty some sure they're words. gonna kill you after they Take talk. a seat on the couch so we can get to talking. Alright, let's listen. So I assume you know why we called you here. I hear you lost some guns. Yeah, we lost some guns, you little weasel. However, we can get more guns. You slowed us down, but you can't stop us. You're gonna die of failure. As a last request, will you tell me more about your plan? Are you shitting me? You didn't even know what the plan was. Yeah. As a last request, I guess we can give you that courtesy. But well, neither did tell me any of this when he convinced me to take you out. The fuck? I knew there had to be someone higher up helping you. Nero, you backstabbing, two-timing motherfucker. I knew this day would come. I'm here! Well. Hello. Over here. Those are some pretty nice suits there. I'm Hey, are you shooting me now? They're not. Good. Well, more goods for me. Hmm. And this looks good. I failed by by love now. Ooh. Poor Joanna. Hey, thanks for all the hard work back there. I'm gonna run a tight ship here, don't you worry. I'm planning on playing some games in the casino. Of course, after all you did for me, here are some chips for you. Play, have some fun. Thank you. Bye. That was not a lot of chips. But a greedy asshole. Oh well. It's not like I'm actually going to use those chips there. Not the casinos anyway. It'd be silly. You have other things to do than bet on things. Yeah. Alright. Back to Gamora. Can we still move? We can! Excellent. I was kinda of worried there for a second because I'm carrying a lot of stuff. We could prepare something, I suppose. How's my carbine doing? Yeah, toss that in there. Other than that, sniper rifles. Always a pleasure to repair those up. Yep. And now I guess we can return to Moore for a moment. Still can't go directly to the... Damn. Well, I skipped myself back here anyway. Uh, by which I mean I edited the video so you didn't see me walking. Outside, in the dark, again, because it wasn't any different from last time, except it was dark. Have you discovered what the Omertas are up to? 
Uh, they were up to something big, but I stopped them before they actually were able to tell me the plan. Excellent. You'd think living in the lap of luxury and power would be enough for some people, but no. But we have other problems. While investigating the Amertas, what little I could on my end, I came across something much more sinister. Evidence suggests that Mr. House is planning to make some kind of move when the battle breaks out, and I'm guessing he won't be coming to our rescue. While we don't know what his exact plans are, my orders are to take no risks. I'm sending you to take Mr. House out of the equation. Any questions? Won't getting rid of Mr. House have huge repercussions for New Vegas? Perhaps, but that's not my problem. Vegas is a nice place for the men to go on vacation, but it'd be an acceptable loss next to the dam. What could he possibly up be up to? To name a few things off the top of my head, expand his borders, get the NCR and Legion to wipe each other out, and seize Hoover Dam. Any other questions? What evidence do you have that Mr. House would make a move? We've had reported sightings of Mr. House's Securitron spying on both NCR and Legion forces. Also, given a recent analysis of the sightings, we now estimate that Mr. House has at least four times as many Securitrons as previously assumed. He wouldn't show his hand like that if he weren't prepared to move. And neither the NCR or Legion can spare the troops to investigate. Which is why I'm sending you. Any other questions? Nope. Good. Then you have your orders. See that Mr. House does not present a problem. Dismissed. In that case... I don't think I actually need to... In, in that case, I'm quite sure I don't actually need to... Huh? I'm feeling quests here. Uh, anyway, in that case... Another quest had. Anyway, in that case, I'm quite sure... Anyway, in that case, I'm quite sure we don't need to actually go and get the ship. Yeah. So, let's see. Do we still have the quest? Hmm. Hey, ring a ding ding is still there. So, it's called Cold Heart. The reunion at midnight science fiction thingy. And, well, the house always wins, will probably not be something that will be part of the equation. Let's just head back on... Oh, we can actually try to hold them now. Good, good. Let's go to the strip. I have a very simple plan. So I wonder if... If you don't kill Penny first, will he rise to power for long enough for me to actually take care of him? Is that a bit curious turn of events? Hmm. Well, we no need to go and get the uh, no iron. Where to, partner? Uh, presidential suit. Yeah. Thank you. Now, what do we get from here? We get. What was it? What's, what's the name? Nephis Golf Driver. Yeah. May as well equip it right now then. Yep. Bedhouse, please. Bedhouse. I do apologize, Mr. House, but. Show's over, kid. Now let's open this up. Yeah. Target. 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 They are angry at me now. Which is to no surprise to anyone, but you know, we can hack this in the meantime. Sunglasses! Not all. Definition! All or nothing. Um, nothing or all, in that case. Yeah. It's kind of weird how it just asks if I'm okay with being a non-authorized user in this case. Okay. It should be working now, right? Come on then. 
Oh right, my allies cannot join me up here. I forgot about that part. I also forgot about the bit when I should have bought more ammo. Okay, let's just go in the elevator. See ya! I don't know if there's any of the enemies over here. Let's just have one of those. Activate the terminal. Unseal the chamber. Infection risk is acceptable. Hello, Mr. House. Why have you done this? Centuries of preparation. So much good undone. Uh, the NCR asked me to get rid of you. Those snakes. For them, you sad, misguided whore. You won't be able to. Nah, time for you to die, Mr. House. May there be a hell for you, a Tartarus, bleak, unending. I like your beard, though. A slave obeys. And <laughs> I killed an abomination, that's nice. Lost karma there. Gained experience there. The house has gone bust. Well, you could say that. Target engaging target. Targeting. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, well. Be advised, the lucky 38 is not open to the general public. Trespassers will be shot. Huh. Well, okay. Let's go to the casino. No, President Institute. We can just use the elevator now without any issues, right? No more need to use Victor for anything. I guess Victor is now lost from the system anyway. Probably. Okay, well. We killed a man. An old man. An aged man. Kind of a shame, really. But you know, I have never tried siding with him. Like, completely. So I don't think we need to look into Benny. Because the house is bust anyway, and if I'm not going for the soul approach. I don't think I need anything else. Yeah. Let's just head back to Moore and tell her the good news. Which is that Smart move apparently it's still a pace. Down. Okay. Report. Is Mr. Howe still a threat? He's dead. Then that's one more nuisance we won't have to worry about. Good work. Our efforts haven't gone unnoticed either. The brass have been throwing around the idea of having the president visit the dam for a while now, to rally the troops and boost morale and such. With our recent achievements, they finally feel secure enough to stage the damn thing. But while it's being planned, I have one last mission for you. Several years ago, we managed to wrest the Helios One solar power station from the Brotherhood of Steel chapter local to this area. It was a crushing victory, but no one's heard a peep from the Brotherhood since. Most people assume the Brotherhood is scattered and not a threat. Recently, we've had scouts go missing in an area west of Helios, and I'm concerned that the Brotherhood is involved. I want you to find them, and once you do, finish them for good. Any questions? Is there no peaceful way to resolve this? Don't even think about it. Any Brotherhood survivors likely harbor a deep grudge against us. We can't afford to leave such an enemy alive. Any other objections? Maybe you'd like to bring the Brotherhood some flowers. Yes, I would. Goodbye. Dismissed. They didn't know who they were messing with. Yeah. 
Morning. Do I talk to Crocker first or do I talk to the Brotherhood first? That's the question. We're on world map. Run to the Brotherhood first. Well, let's go see about that. Oh, we cannot fast travel from indoors. Who would have imagined? Let's go see about talk to the elder first then. But I will do that next time. So thanks for watching. I'll see you then. Yeah. Battle music. Because crabs, I think. Scorpions even. Yeah. See ya. Okay, I can't hear shit. We can't wait right now. How do I set the weather to be less shit? <laughs>